Well, crap. What did I just do? Oh, no. <laughs> Alright, what is up? Uh, today, I'm just gonna do a quick re uh, add-on review of the GTA 5 muscle car add-on. It adds quite a bit of GTA 5 muscle cars straight from the video game. As you can see here on this Dominator, which is obviously a Mustang, it looks great. Like, it's pretty much the same exact car. I mean, they just took the model and uh, put it straight into Gary's mod. So, yeah, great job by the person. Uh, I'll tell you his name in just a second. Let me find it. Okay, his name is Winning Rook, and I'll put his uh, link to his Steam profile in the description below, where you can find all of his workshop content. And he, he has a pretty cool profile, so definitely go check his profile out. Uh, so shout out to him for making this. This is a great add-on. Uh, of course, this add-on wouldn't be possible without a few others, such as the GTA. He made a texture pack for it, so he has to. So you have to get the textures for the cars, uh, or else it will be just a big pink error. So the, ma the mod that is required for these cars to work is called this Simfiz. I don't know, Simfiz. Uh, it's basically uh, an add-on that makes racing and car physics a lot more realistic and more fun. Uh, more enjoyable for you and your friends to go around and drive around play on the racetrack. So of course today we're at Upstate Speedway Road Course. So it's pretty beautiful out here. We got the Vertigo Blue Dominator here. Yep, Vapid. Pretty sick. And Andreas right there. Alright, so this mod comes with quite a bit of cars. I'll show you some in a little bit, but for right now, I'm gonna go ahead and take this puppy for a spin to show you how these things drive and what the engine does and how. Not the car's engine, but like. You know what I mean, the. The combination of add ons. I was driving a few other cars and the other cars. Whoa! Um, jeez. Alright. Just bad driving. Alright, that didn't happen. Oh my god, again! <laughs> Sorry, I'm a bad driver right now. Alright, so, this add-on is very fun. Uh, you can press down space to drift, just like in GTA. If you guys don't have it, that's what you do. You can press shift to do, like a, I don't know what you call it, like a speed drift. Uh, space is like the manual break so you can like I don't know it's pretty cool so here we are back at the start of the racetrack so you could see that was pretty cool um, and this is just one of the many cars I haven't even talked to you guys about the customization of these vehicles you can when you press C and hover over the vehicle itself it will come out highlighted uh, right click on it and you can change the body groups like front bumper you just saw that change right down there to the left uh, the hood I can change that, the roof, you know, there, there's just so many different things you can change on the cars just like in normal GTA 5. So that's what I like about this add-on. You can change the skin, you know, like the color. I like it. I think I'm going to go with white. What was that? Yeah, skin 2. Okay. So that white looks pretty good. Uh, let's go ahead and add the front bumper on. Yep. That looks pretty good. So right now you can't change the wheels, but there may or may not be an uh, update coming on soon to where you can do that, but we'll see about that in the future. So I was going to do a little bit of the review down there, but I kind of, yeah, I screwed some stuff up. A few cars may or may not have blown up down there, so we're just going to go ahead and continue add-on review up here. So here you see you got a few um, categories in this uh, menu up here next to vehicles. In between vehicles and entity, you'll see the Simfiz. Uh, there's actually like a drivable couch. I don't know how that works. Whatever, that's not a part of the add-on. Uh, but this does not come with the add-on, but it is a part of the Simfiz. But what we're going to do here is I'm going to show you a few of the... I'll spawn in all of them and I'll test drive a few more show you how the uh, the cars in this add-on uh, work. Alright, so here are all the cars in the add-on. Uh, the pack 
uh, in each and every one of these cars you can customize to a certain extent uh, it's just crazy like how much thought and effort this guy put into this like I don't think I could ever do this oh my god all right uh, we're not gonna mess around with that I mean I'll deck out a car I'll I'll choose a few we'll choose this one we'll do the Phoenix because you can get a pretty cool GT wing on that I do believe so I'm gonna go customize these real fast and I'll get right back to you all right well I've customized these cars I think they look pretty cool <laughs> They truly are muscle cars. We'll drive the Ruiner first, just because I want to save the best for last, in my opinion. Uh, so let's go ahead and drive this thing around. It's really tough to get used to just from like the default Gary's Mod racing, because all the cars in Gary's Mod without this add-on are just like crazy. So right now what I'm doing is I'm, I'm just, oh, I probably shouldn't be doing that, holding shift on the turns and it's like really accelerating me through them oh my god it's so tough to drive we'll give her another lap okay 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 let's do a speed test actually <laughs> oh my god <laughs> maybe not oh shoot <laughs> oh god okay that was pretty cool that was smooth oh god oh god i hate this turn uh <laughs> holy crap oh almost tipped the car you know what i'm just gonna take it nice and easy Nice and easy. Really been making it look like it's hard to drive these. I mean, it's not the easiest thing, but definitely not as hard as I'm making it. <laughs> Alright. So that was that car. Let's go ahead and hop into this Phoenix. I love this car. Alright. Let's go. This thing turns a lot sharper. Oh god. I'm getting the hang of this. Maybe. Oh god, I almost keep tipping the freaking car. Oh, off the road. That is my bad. Oh, mm. Alright, you know what? Oh, that's cool. I didn't know they did that. Look at that. Look at the wheels. That's sick. It makes it look so cool. How do you do that? How do I do that? Oh, ho, ho. So what you do is you just hold A or D and then press E at the same time and it will stick. <laughs> that is sick. So, as you guys know, these cars do blow up. Uh, as you should have seen at the beginning of this video. But, we're going to go ahead and do a little destruction if we can before the end. So, let's go ahead and do that. Alright, let's throw a few grenades down there. Oh, there's a fire on the hot. Oh, that's sick. Look at that. They're on fire. <gasps> oh god all right you know what that was pretty cool I'm not gonna lie it's just really cool to see this hmm all right well I really enjoyed this uh, add-on pack I really like the detail on the cars and how hard uh, the creator has worked on these um you really made it enjoyable and yeah i'd recommend this add-on <laughs> there they, they go uh yeah i'd recommend this for people that like cars and like racing so thank you for watching and see you in the next video